What's up, everybody, and welcome back to the channel. My name is Harris. I'm once again joined by Justin, and today we're going to be reacting to episodes 119 and 120 of Hunter Hunter. Yep, that's right, guys. Pretty hyped for these episodes. We left off with that crazy cliffhanger where we might get Killua UP 1v1. I don't think Killua can handle him, but we know Killua has leveled up ever since he's taken that needle out of his head, right? So I'm hyped to see him actually, maybe, maybe, because I've been asking this. If you guys have seen the videos, you know I've been asking for this. I want to see Killua actually go all out, being pushed like he might die. So maybe we'll get that. Hopefully, hopefully. He just came to come down like the crater with lightning in his hands, fucking Pikachu after the Thunderbolt and shit. He's Paralyzed like, I'm ready to, like a Pikachu. I'm ready to fucking destroy this guy, right? After, uh, you know, giving Knuckle the moment, the opportunity before, you know, he almost got bodied. Dude, and, uh, I was nervous. Knuckle had his moment, yeah. punched the shit out of him. It's pretty, pretty good, pretty good, yeah. pretty good moment. M Knuckle definitely gave him a combo. <laughs> He's hit him with eight punches, I think he said, so. But, yeah, oh, but the bigger thing is how now how big APR is gonna yes. be. I wanna see a big uh -huh. ass fairy, man. <laughs> Annoying UP even more. I don't know if he'll be able to slap it away this time like he was. He's anyway. probably gonna be scared, honestly. That might give Killua the window that you know he's very confident up to this point. Maybe there'll be enough for him to like I don't know, deliver a final blow, potentially? Maybe, but as we've seen, Yuppie is learning how he, like, as he fights, as we saw in the last episode. He's just learning True. more about himself, so maybe he's not that dumb muscle head that we thought he was originally. So we'll have to see kind of how that fight takes shape, but I'm definitely excited for that. Uh, I guess the other thing we should touch on before we go into it is that it looks like Ikalgo has lost his disguise, so he might have to go his normal form incognito, because nobody really knows what happened to him but in his regular form, right? Yeah, nobody knows. Um, Bravada, Bravada is basically took care of the corpse flutter. Yeah. Um, you know, because after he gave himself away, saying Hagia instead of Leol. Um, now it's just gonna be like, is is Palm really dead? Mm -hmm. You know, it, as, after she left the message, uh, will it call go find her, or is it gonna be really true? I don't know. Yeah. Get to all these questions. Hopefully, we'll find out soon because we still got so many more fights left that we got to get to. And there's a lot of storylines right now oh. that are kind of just like coming together. So, yes. um, we still haven't gotten to the point where we'll see Netro versus the King oh. yet. You know, they're just flying over there. That's true. Um, but you know, I'm excited to get to this Killua versus UP thing. And um, if you've been liking Hunter Hunter, be sure that you leave a like on the video, subscribe to the channel if you have not already, and join the Patreon because we're miles ahead on Patreon as opposed to YouTube. So if you want to see um, everything like this, everything, all the fights start to finish, join the Patreon. And with that, let's get right into these two episodes and see what happens. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Super Saiyan Kill. Okay. Super Saiyan Kill. Ultra Instinct. <laughs> The fuck? Is he like what super fast now? He's a flash? He's the flash. Whoa! Yo, he can go faster than you be. Bro. Yo, kill a level the hell up! The hell is this? Godspeed. Godspeed, God speed, soldier! So he is like the flash. <laughs> He's just going so fast. He's bodying his ass. I... Holy. His god speed, it, it made him, it made him Barry Allen. Making a... So he's using the electricity on his body? Was it like trying to make it... Oh shit. Oh shit! Dude, oh shit! <laughs> Into two different abilities. Speed of lightning. And whirlwind. So it's like fast reaction time and controlling his body, okay. What's the drawback? Oh yeah. Okay, so this is where he learned it. Holy fuck! So he's going faster than the neurons could get to his brain. Holy shit, this is like Ultra Instinct! Well, I guess Ultra Instinct is like this. I, I really want to know what the drawback of this is. Is he just going to get tired real quick? Or? Wait, all these guys have less than 10% of my raw power. So is he like actually not doing any damage to Yubi? That's oh, the yeah. whirlwind. How much damage is this doing him though? 
He said it's like... He might be fast, but is he actually doing damage? Oh fuck, this is what we were talking about and he's learning as he fights. Is he about to get his net ability? Oh shit. Oh shit. Dude, Kilo like pieced him up, but Yubi doesn't look like he's been affected at all. Yeah. Uh oh. Like he ran out of juice? Oh fuck. Oh, he ran out of juice. Oh no, run, Kilo, run. Melorian. Okay, run. Get the fuck out of there. Oh no, shoot thing disappeared. Did the shoot just die? Oh shit, that's right, what was oh, it? He shit. has three times. He's gonna blow he has, up. Yeah, he has, yeah, then the third time is the blow up. Octillery! Can't he just break out? I like this animation. This animation is so fucking adorable. <laughs> Let me out! Let me out! I need to get out! <laughs> Look at his little fucking walk. <laughs> That's my little buddy. I like him. Oh, wow. Oh. Okay, so he's not going to be able to do it. The narrator would not have told us that if it wasn't important, right? <sighs> he's not going to be able to kill somebody. Yeah. Oh fuck, he is oh. breaking out. Run, little buddy, run, run! Run! Oh fuck. Time to sneaky sneaky. Oh no, I hope Ikago doesn't die. Not our little buddy. Not my little buddy, man. Or is this where Palm comes back and says she's still alive and helps? Oh, time for the gas. <laughs> is Bravado playing an escape room right now? What the hell is happening? Uh oh. Trapped. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh, oh. no. All right, that was clever. I'll give you two. That was, that was very clever. clever. Dude, that's why I said he just revealed. Like, these doors don't just magically do this by themselves. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. <laughs> Rip. All right, he's smarter than Chitu. Chitu would have just ran in there. <laughs> What's the way out? What's the way? Is that that, that small ass little door on the right? What is that? Wait, can he climb up the elevator? But the sleeping gas is there. But we're gonna run him over with a tank? Oh, here we go. Run him over. Oh yeah, this is a one-way ticket, right? Yep. Or maybe that's what Ikago wants in the thing. Because we saw him with the hose. It looked like some alcohol, a lighter. Oh, is he gonna is he gonna blow him up? That could be it, like distract him, blow him up, and then run away. Let's go, run him that's over! A, that's a fast fucking tank. That's right, squish him. Oh fuck. Oh no. Drift! Drift! Oh, he blocked the elevator. Wait, was this the plan? 
Okay, that's what I figured, but wouldn't the sleeping gas have affected him? I guess not. Oh, true. So now he's gonna set the tank on fire, okay. So is then he gonna climb up the elevator? Smoke! Was there another way to get out? He's gonna use the smoke as cover. Ah, good, true, true. And he's so small, you can he won't notice. Oh, he's using a oh, breathing tube so he doesn't have to get affected by the gas? Yeah. I was like, he could fit through that. Kogo, the smart guy. Alrighty, Kogo. You're gonna have to take him out. I know you've never killed anybody. But he had the X on his yes. eyes. Come on, Don't bro. do it. Don't, you're pure, Kogo. Don't do it. You're a good guy. Oh my god, I don't know. Should he do it? I don't know. Oh, he's about to vomit. Oh no, he can't hold his breath. Okay. Oh, he did vomit. Ugh. He did. He couldn't do it. Oh, it's okay. It's okay, man. You're a good guy. My little boy. Oh, my boy. This is tough. You like, would your opponent actually leave himself vulnerable like this, or is it a trap? I don't know. <laughs> what would you do? Yeah. It's definitely a trap. Trust your instincts, I guess. Just trust it. Yeah. Will you activate my trap card? <laughs> I mean, at this point, I think Shia LaBeouf has already just vacated the premises. Yeah, it's probably an empty show. It's true, he's not making an impulsive decision. He's literally thinking it through. I hope we don't get a whole episode with Moro just staring at the cocoon. I hope not. I hope not. <laughs> What? The, I'm confused. Oh. So he was outside. Yeah. Okay, so him okay. looking to attack was a test. Why is it getting dark? What the fuck? Darker. This is a this is fake. He's lying. Oh no. We saw him escape. So I guess it's only been like three or five minutes. What the hell? What is happening? The tiny particles? So he's like, what, spread oh. himself? He's everything, everywhere, all at once? What's this? Did he turn himself into little poop? He turn it? Look at this little... He, oh, he made a bunch what of little fuck? ones. What the <laughs> fuck? Look at the little guys. Cell juniors. So what, is he like, like you said, everywhere, everything, everything all? everywhere, all Is he just going once. everywhere now? Then puppets. I don't think you can get Small enough puppets. puppets to get rid of all those little guys. Oh, <laughs> uh, and they're gone. Or he just makes more. Is it like like the Hydra? When you cut one head off, you can't. You just make more. What the oh, hell is going shit. on? But he's a fucking butterfly. <laughs> no, there has to be like one one that you can kill. Maybe there's only like one yes. central one. Huh? Oh shit! What? Uh oh. Oh no! Is this where Moro's about to be taken out? Oh no! <laughs> No, he took his pipe! 
He's gone. What the fuck? He took his weed! <laughs> uh -oh. oh, fuck. Oh, no. Oh, shoot, shit. Dad. What is... His fucking eyes. What is happening? 89 deep purple puppets. Okay. Killua, where are you? Have you recovered? Oh, they're all knuckles. Oh, so to make him confused so the real knuckle can hit him and get some more shots with, the, with uh, on APR. She's trolling you. She's trolling you. Is she into money? I don't know. Oh. Okay, that was easy. No, the pipe. Lost forever. <laughs> okay, so that's the central one. Bro, he looks, they look so funny. Shit. So he's like infinite. He's literally infinite. Mate, hold on. Can only be reduced to a B's okay. size. Oh, so his main body is trapped. Oh. So, so his main body was probably inside the smoky gel when he destroyed the cocoon, but it was like very small. It was very small. Well, it had to have been a bee size though. So where was the real poo? Hiding behind, behind one of the Wow. <laughs> Look at him. And he would have won. Because his poop yeah. said he was like half his power. Oh, he would have squished him. Look at him. True, so his his clones could have still done stuff. But he would have defeated Poof. Rip, man. Okay, but yeah, like you say, if he didn't arrive, Knuckle would not... Yeah, okay, so if he didn't do this, Knuckle probably would be dead. It could be said so he made the... So it, it depends on what you value. If you wanted to say, like, he, he could have taken out Poof, right? Or you wanted to save Knuckle's life. I'm gonna say I want to save Knuckle's life, so I will say... Uh, save, save our boy, save our boy Knuckle. I'm good, I'm good with this. <laughs> Every time I see somebody fighting Yuffie, they sweat. It's like, shit. I... Yes. <laughs> what was that? So as long as the real one hits, that APR will go up. Oh shit, he's gonna uh -oh. take all these out in less than a minute. No, I do not want that to happen. No, I, I got scared for a sec. <laughs> and these two are still right here. The hell is that? What is that? The human captured. The human captured. Is that Palm? No, did they turn her into an ant? They turned Palm into an ant. Are you a Little Poo fan? Dude, Little Poof is adorable. <laughs> oh, now we have to find the king. I actually wonder where they are. Where the hell are they? Oh, they could see the Little Poofs! Oh! Oh, thank goodness. There's another clone. Oh, now you're sweating, huh, Yupi? Oh, shit, the one that showed up was fake. Oh! Remember when we saw the eyes? So that one was fake, too. Oh, they played him! They played him! Oh, he's gonna explode! Oh, shit. Angry clones. <laughs> okay. 
Wow, okay, so this this was planned way back. Way back, yeah. <laughs> He's embarrassed he loses his temper, yeah. but it worked out. Yeah. I'm assuming this is shoot wait okay. Wow, he is in terrible shape. Holy shit. Oh shit. Nov did save him. Come on man, my man's defeated. I I know, but He did good. He he, he did good. He did well. Yeah. He did well. Oh, fuck. Oh. What are you doing, Poof? What are you doing, Poof? Does he just want to know where the king is? Is he going to attack Gon? I think Poof is going to try to kill Kamugi. That could be it, too. Are we going to actually have a P2 Poof fight? That could happen, I guess. I could potentially happen. Okay, so two wild com and completely kind of different episodes. The first episode, we got that hype, ga uh, the, sorry, the Killua and Yuffie fight. And we have learned mm -hmm. that Killua has leveled up his Nen, right? He can now do two things with his lightning. He has something called God Speed, which branches off into Whirlwind and Lightning. So, yeah. Okay. And then it seems like the drawback was there is a time limit to for him to like encompass this form. Yeah, which, which would make sense because he uh, just yeah. learned it and uh, he's very new with it. And it looks like it was probably less than a minute. Like that it was longer for us, but like three minutes of an episode is like 10 seconds of anime time. So it's probably I like... I mean, yeah. The What was it? The invasion happened and then the narrative said it was like, what, five minutes yeah. or something that happened? Yeah, and that was like five episodes. So it was probably definitely yep. like 10 to 20 seconds because he was also moving like at the speed of sound. So he's like moving super fast. As... And, okay, like getting some hits on Yuppie, but I don't know if it, it was actually doing damage though. No, even Yuppie said all these guys are less than 10% of my raw power, which when you put that into perspective it's like that means he's on a completely different scale which goes back to okay. how the hell is how strong is the fucking king because the king is on a different scale from the royal guards right so it's like we have the royal guard tier and then the king is even on a higher tier it's not it's not even like they're close which makes me nervous for netero but if netero as we found out in the netero uh little backstory he is like ridiculously strong so if he yep. can actually hold his own against the king or even beats the king then i i don't think anybody could beat that guy ever ever <laughs> i remember way back uh like i think it was one of the first few episodes remember when he was asking everybody who you want to fight or who you don't want to fight in the hunter exam and hasoka's like uh i want to fight you yeah i don't think you want those problems Hisoka. Hisoka. i don't think i don't think you want to fight him no. after uh what we know yeah, he would fuck you up so uh, he would I don't destroy it. He would squish you like a bug. And actually, speaking of Ahsoka, this would definitely be a good time for Ahsoka because I definitely think he'd be getting pretty excited about fighting these ants uh, if they're as strong as he, he would. Fucking so. ooze on the floor <laughs> if he saw like what the heck the amount of people that were here. Yes, he's missing out. But uh, I guess uh, we're saving him for something else down the line, probably because uh, let's. I've always wondered why they didn't get more people, but that's. Maybe that would be explained more to me because if they had like I think Zeno, Silva, the Phantom Troop, Hisoka, um, all these people come and help, I definitely think it would have been a lot easier. But maybe that would be explained later. But I mean, I guess they really wanted to just minimize some yeah, casualty casualties. if there were. So. Yeah, and then people getting absorbed or something. I think that was the main thing they were afraid of. So, yeah, we have that. I mean, ab speaking of absorbed, yeah, like. True. The human that was captured, I'm thinking that's Paul. Yes. Uh, and the question is now, is she an ant? How did she turn into an ant? And is she on our side then now too, right? Because yes. there's a few questions there. And um, yeah, I guess maybe we'll find out later as once she ever hatches from that cocoon. And then what's Gon's reaction going to be? He's going to be like, what? Is he going to be crushed? Yeah, probably. Because I mean... that's going to be two people now that the ants have kind of taken and messed up that were part of his life and he's gonna as we've already seen how much kites has affected him so yes uh, so we have all that storyline and now we have i guess the poof and moral fight kind of wrapped up right like whatever their fight was standoff um sure i mean it looked like what's it called uh he got played he got played pretty bad i mean yeah just, just basically that's getting, all we can say splitting himself down into those clones escaping but the central unit was still in the smoky jail 
But like you can, I guess you can equate that to Zij like you can just say that was it the correct decision? And I think it was, right? Because he did it to save Knuckle. Yeah, he he friends. was worried about his students and his uh, and his friends. Like that's like what the narrator was saying. He made a judgment in like a rash judgment, but um, he kind of had two choices. He could have taken, he could have thought clearly and maybe like come up with the reasoning like, oh wait, why would this thing still be here? And if the main body's still here, he probably like um, Poof he probably said he would have killed Poof. Yeah, he would have killed, killed him. Uh, but he risked the fact that those clones that Poof had on the outside could have hurt his friends, like he said, or he wouldn't be able to protect them like he was doing with Yuffie. So I agree. I think he made the right decision. Um, yeah. Obviously, it's coming that's, back to like do you value mission. That's still so crazy though. It's still so crazy crazy how they told us that and I'm just like oh shit that's insane like the this is when the narrator is just discussing that whole yes, situation like, I was like dude that's that's crazy yeah and just the more dilemma do you stick with the mission or do you save the people right I think that's like even happens in real life right like when people have you have a mission or do you protect and you gotta kind of figure out for yourself but like mm -hmm. we said we agree with moral and I guess we kind of got more um info on to I guess what Pooh's powers are like right he's actually I don't even know what you want to describe it as, but like he can break himself down, come together. We haven't seen any combat related stuff, but like this is what I've been wondering too. Maybe Poof is not a fighter. We know he has like nasty Nen, but I don't know if he can actually fight. Like it seems to just be more like it seems recon more like sort of stuff. Yeah, recon controlling. Yeah. Like he, he can see feelings, manipulate. Yeah, too. So uh, I wonder if we we'll actually see him fight because as we saw at the end of this last episode, he is now in the same room as P2 and Gon. And uh, yes. probably gonna either look for info on the king or, like you said, try to kill Kamugi because uh, he hates her. <laughs> so um, yes. we will kind of see where that picks off. We know Gon has one purpose. I'm gonna fuck up P2. He probably doesn't even care about <laughs> Poof. He's like, yeah, I have, I have one mission. He will definitely stick to the mission, right? As we see, he doesn't care about anything else. He's making sure he kills P2. Um, so. We have that going on, and uh, I guess we should also talk about we have, I guess, Knuckle and not Shoot anymore, but Knuckle and Moro versus UP. Oh, oh yeah, I mean, I, I, I honestly just want to see more, and uh, just I want to get to the point. I just want to get to the point of the fucking King versus Netero, honestly. Yeah, I mean, it feels like we're getting closer, right? I mean, we haven't seen. P2 or Poof really fight yet, but Yuppie has been going out these last eight episodes, right? He's actually been like... No, like, we, we've been focused on Yuppie, yeah. like, this not too long, and it's just like, different people have been trying to go against him, but nothing. it seems like nothing's working. Yeah. It's like, how many people does it actually take to take out a royal guard? And if it takes this many people, how... How many people does it take to screw a fucking light bulb? <laughs> yeah. How many people does it take to fight a muscle head meatball? I mean, well, he is smarter than that. I will give him credit. He's, he is, he's he is getting learning smarter. as he fights. Getting so smarter. We will see yeah. what the aftermath is after Knuckle punched him before the explosion, how big APR will be, where we go from there. Um, but yeah, I think that's going to do it for us, guys. Two wild episodes. Feels like we're getting closer now to, I guess, maybe the wrap-up of the UP fight and more into P2 and Poof and then eventually Netero. I'm guessing that will be the last fight. Um, but we'll see when that time comes. But yeah, don't forget to let us know down in the comments below what you guys thought. Don't forget to drop that like. And like Harris mentioned in the beginning, we do have a Patreon. So if you are interested in seeing our full-length reaction to this and all the other shows on our channel, check out that link. We're also quite a bit of ways or further down by the time this is out on YouTube. By the time this is out, we'll probably be done with this log and close to finish with the series. So if you want to see where we are currently, check out that link as well. And yeah, is there anything you want to wrap up? Nope, that is pretty much it. Thanks for watching some Hunter Hunter with us. Uh, don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, join the Patreon, and we'll see you in the next one. Peace.